This is Duel Invaders. Duel. Dual Invaders. Let's go with Duel Invaders. As strange as the name is, it's pretty fitting. Duel Invaders is a shoot 'em up in the classic vein of Space Invaders and Galaga, but with an interesting twist. As you might expect from a title like that, the gameplay revolves around the duality of the gameplay. Duel Invaders takes the fixed nature of a shoot 'em up like Space Invaders, flips it on its side, literally, and gives control over two ships. The duel, uh, D-U-A-L in the name, comes from the single player and cooperative mode. Ship control is respectively given to the two players in the latter mode, but single player doesn't give you an AI partner. Instead, you control both red and blue ships as you try to destroy the somehow perfectly color-coordinated aliens. So that's an interesting concept, but it's kind of hard to control. As you sink a little more time into the decent alien obliterating action, it's much easier to get used to the confusing control scheme, but in the meantime, you'll find yourself missing a lot of the enemies and instead destroying your other ship. Even then, it still feels a bit awkward. And for a game that obviously draws on the easy to learn, hard to master arcade games of yesteryear, that fault is magnified. And from what I understand, both the dual, DUA, and EL modes are played with one controller or PSP. I can barely coordinate a co-op game with my friends in the same room, let alone on the same controller. While control is obviously key to playing a video game, the rest of Duel Invaders does a bit to alleviate the potential frustration lying in the vertical confusion. Not much though. As I briefly mentioned earlier, the ships and their hostile counterparts are color-coded, and not just for fashion's sake. Red enemies destroyed by the red ship net more points and vice versa. Red enemies can be destroyed by your blue ship, but it won't contribute nearly as much to the all-important high score. Like its inspiration, Duel Invaders places an emphasis on score through the interesting color mechanic and numerous power-ups that include improved fire and multiple lives. And you'll need those lives if you want to go for beating that high score, as the single player is a typical see how far you can go before game over affair. For a certain kind of people, that's wonderful motivation to try over and over. For others, and most with today's gaming structure, that kills the desire to sink even more time into the game. Overall, I would think the game is time sink worthy. On another platform and with a few more modes. As it stands, Duel Invaders is an interesting concept with some jarring control issues that is only present on PSP, and outdated in large handheld, and PS3, a home console. If you really want a game that pays homage to Space Invaders and old school shoot 'em ups with an interesting twist, Duel Invaders may be right up your alley. Otherwise, Duel Invaders may be as beneficial to your wallet and time as a duel with Aaron Burr is to your health. Relevancy!